Hi, and welcome back to the channel. Today, well, today we're going to go through the little green nuke. Now, if you didn't stay till the end of the last video, the nuke has changed colors. It's no longer blue, it's now green because blue is bad luck. Anyways, very limited today. We're going to go through the green nuke. We're going to try to find the queen. And if we cannot find one, we're going to go through the blue hive. Now that's a pheromone they should be used to. And we're going to grab a frame of eggs, if we can find one, out of the blue hive and put them in here and give them the opportunity to make a queen if they haven't already started making one with the eggs from Juno. Uh, something else that we're going to do, and now this is on a recommendation from both Sweetest Stings Apiary and Pine City Apiary, they said on the yellow hive that I should reverse the boxes. The bees are laying eggs in the medium, and I'm going to move the medium to the bottom, bring the deep up to the top, in hopes that they'll draw that out. So that's what we're going to do, and while I get my gear on, some folks have sent us some pictures. I believe his name is Jeffrey Cornett. He sent us some pictures of his hives that he'd like to share, so I'm going to share them with you. Now, these hives are built by Jeffrey and painted by his 14-year-old daughter. And his 14-year-old daughter, it looks like she's going to be an artist. All right, well, boy, those were some beautiful hives. And I tell you what, if you want to share your hives with the community, do me a favor, send some pictures to gabugfarmer at gmail.com. You can find it on the About page of this channel. And uh, I'll be happy to show your hives to the, uh, to the rest of the community if you don't have a YouTube channel. Heck, you may want to show your entire apiary. We'll show that too. All right, what we want to see in here is a queen or a queen cell. I don't think we're going to find a queen. Hi girls. We have quite a lot of bees in here. Let's just go through these frames one at a time and see what we can see. But the biggest concentration of bees is right here. So they have something going on there. Still nothing happening there, but that is one of the new double waxed frames. Well, they are starting to starting to draw it out. That's a good sign. Now, usually when a hive doesn't have any queen, they are very, very, very defensive. So I'm going very slow and very steady, even though this is a small nuke. Now they are storing. They are storing nectar. And there's some bee bread, so they're bringing in pollen. Just going to move this over. We have a lot of bees on here. Uh, looks like they're drawing out. Looks like they're drawing out wax. That's a good thing. Okay, so now this next frame. This is the frame with all the bees on it on both sides. Hopefully, they're going to have a queen cell. Better yet, maybe that little queen was on a mating flight and she came back. Okay. Get off there. I've got to put my fingers there, girly. Okay. Okay, we have a queen cell being drawn out. Very small queen cell. We have a queen cell. No queen on this side. Oh no. Well, that bee was just on my finger and I didn't even think. I just squashed it. I could have got lit up. Okay, we do not have a working queen on this side of the frame.
but if we take a look right here we have a very small queen cell being drawn out it's actually it's capped already so that's good so the question is do I put more bees in here or do I just let them go with their new queen cell I think I'm just gonna let them go see what they do And if you notice, because they have a queen cell in here, they're very calm. You would expect a, a hive with no queen to be very agitated, but they're not. All right, girls. Going back in. I'm just going to close you up. So I guess so far, the green hive is turning out to be good luck. Now, why did I choose green? Well, I didn't choose green because I thought green was a lucky color. I chose green because I just fixed up a John Deere lawnmower. I'll show you a picture here. And I had some green John Deere grass green paint left over, and there you go. All right, let's, uh, let's go to the yellow hive and flip the boxes. All right, so if the queen has moved down to the bottom, I'm not going to do anything, but if the queen is still in that medium, I'm just going to flip the boxes really quick. I think that's the right thing to do. Ooh, ho ho! Smoke. Hi, oh, girls. I know, I know. We've got screen bottom boards. I'll shoot some smoke up that way, too. Give it a second to get through the hive. Long enough. All right, ladies. Be happy. Do not sting the bug farmer. No stingeroni. Oh, there's a lot of bees. Oh, she is still laying up here. There's larva right on the top. So I'm going to have to make sure that I do not see the queen up here. And I do not. Set this over here for a moment. Okay. Well, we know she's laying up here. Okay, I've got a guard on me already. Okay. Gosh, I really hate tearing up that brood. Yeah, I see you. I see you. I've angered you. I see you. Go ahead and clean these off really fast. Up there. Okay, girls, we're going for a ride. Oh, that's a heavy box. Okay. Well, you know, I may have the queen down here. I'm going to have to look. This hive has exploded. Okay. They're drawing out. They're drawing out these frames. Even if the queen is not down here, I'm going to uh, I'm going to leave this box, and then what I'm going to do is put another. I'm going to put a queen excluder and a medium super on here, because this box is packed. That box is packed. The the only frames that aren't full. The yellow hive triggers the stingometer. Yellow hive just got the stingometer. First one of the year. Son of a gun. All right. All right. I see you. 
I see you. Man, that hurt. All right, ladies. Okay, fully drawn now. They're starting to store. See, there is a empty teacup, and I am going to remove that one. That one is a goner. No need to have it on there. Okay, we have some we have some bee bread in there. We have some nectar. No eggs yet. I have a feeling we're going to find eggs on the next frame. I have a feeling if I don't put my gloves on, I'm going to get stung. Give me a moment. The yellow hive is already on the board for the year. We don't want them to, to really light up the board. All right, girls. Okay, there is a light frame, but we have we have brood down here, so that means the queen is down here and she is laying. Let's see if we can find her. We have eggs all over this frame. Tells me our queen is here. We have eggs all over this frame. There's a girl with some bright orange pollen. I do not see the queen. <laughs> but I know she's here. I do not see her on this frame, but boy, I tell you what, I see evidence that she's been on this frame. Gently move that right there. The girls, a little more smoke. I want to squash you. Okay, I see milk brood in here. So that tells me my queen is in the other direction because the other two frames had eggs. There she is. There she is right there. Here's our queen. So we know she's in the bottom box. We are going to go ahead and put this hive back together carefully. And then we are going to give them a queen excluder and a medium super to fill up because they've already started filling this box with honey. Okay, draw that out for me ladies. Draw this. Back on the hive. All right, I'll be right back. Let me get a medium super. All right, girls, here's a queen excluder. Get the queen down there. Here is a brand new box for you. So maybe you can, you can take part in the harvest this year. Okay, now I have to get the bee aggravator, bee agitator. The bee aggregator, but I like to call it the, the agitator because that's what it's going to do. So now we have to get these girls off of here, get rid of the cattywampus comb. This is just not going to be fun. There's no real easy way to do this. No easy way to do that without making them mad. Down in there. Down in there. All right, there you go. You're in. You're in. I know, I know. Worst thing ever. Worst thing ever. All right, well, there you go. We managed to accomplish our goals today. The little green nuke is doing what I hoped it would do. It's actually making its own queen. So I'm not going to add any more eggs or anything to it. I'm just going to kind of let them do what it is that they want to do. And I'm hoping they're going to be all right. I think the green hive is going to be good luck. I hope. 
We also went through the Yellow Hive and Sweetest Stings Apiary and Pine City Apiary. They both recommended that I flip those boxes because the queen was up in the top medium and I couldn't seem to get them to draw out anything on the bottom. But they've started to draw out the frames on the bottom and she's laying down there. So I'm not going to do anything. Threw on a queen excluder and a new medium super and hopefully the Yellow Hive is going to be able to take part in the, in the harvest this year. Maybe we're going to get some honey from her after all. And the Yellow Hive also was the first one to light off the stingometer this year so welcome back to the stingometer she lit me up right on the right wrist no fun but it happens so yellow hive is on the board let's hope that's the only hive that's on the board maybe they'll win with a grand total of one sting at the end of 2021 also i want to thank jeffrey Cornett for the pictures of his hives and again if you have pictures of your hives or your apiary that you would like to share do me a favor send them to gabugfarmer at gmail.com I'd be happy to put them on the uh, on the site and show off your your hives to our subscribers. With all that said, I want to thank you for watching. If you like this video, do me a favor, give me a thumbs up. If you have something to say, by all means, please comment. And if you haven't subscribed, do me a favor, hit the subscribe button, ring the bell to be notified of my new content. And I try to drop a video every Friday. I hope you come along for the adventure. With all that said, I want to thank you for watching. Be happy. And I'll see you next week. Have a great day. This week, the Yellow Hive kicks off the 2021 season. The season total stands at 1.